Hello, I want to be the first to welcome you to GearHost, and thank you for using our Octane product. Let's talk about where to get started with Octane so you can start developing what matters to you. First, we need to go into your account. All that is required is an email address, yes we verify it's real, and a password. It is now time to add our first cloud site. We will click Add Cloud Site. We will give our site a name. We will call this Test Site. Notice that we do give you a custom URL so you can visit this site once it is created. We do have three plans that you can choose from, a free, a shared, or a reserved. To use the shared or reserved, you do need to update your billing information. You can create an empty cloud site, or if you would like to install a predefined application, you can choose Create Cloud Site from Gallery. This will allow you to install things like WordPress. I'm going to go ahead and select the free version for now and create an empty cloud site. The last step in setting up our first cloud site is setting up our deployment credentials. Setting up deployment credentials allows us to FTP files from our local computer to the cloud. To set up these deployment credentials, you're going to create a username. I'm going to go ahead and use test user again and my password. Please note that the password does have to have some complexity to it, at least a special character and a number. Password was changed successfully. And this is going to create a user that I can use. This test site test user. And this is the FTP host. If I want, I can go ahead and file FTP my files up there using this host, this full user and my password. I connect. And now I'm allowed to take my website from wherever it is on my local computer, my web group. Again, I'd like to say thanks for choosing GearHost and welcome. If you have anything that you need help with, we are always here to help.